Welcome ladies and gentlemen. Hello, this is the Strange Sides of Gaming. I'm your host Vlado and I am absolutely ill. <coughs> this is not going to be a very good episode voice-wise. It has never been, but still. What do you know? Maybe it's going to be better in some aspect. Uh, anywho, so we, on today's agenda, we have to go through the palace in the Undis... Is it, okay. We have to go through the palace in the... Oh. Can I combine those? I am getting... Um, I'm getting very distracted, ladies and gentlemen. I'm so sorry. So... We have to uh, get the to through the passage inside of the pa inside of the castle into the temple of the seven seals was it or something and we need to talk to Atma. Oh whoa 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 whoa! <laughs> uh, sound is off. Sorry about that. Sound was off. A little bit off, but still. <coughs> I apologize, ladies and gentlemen, but... I really wanted to do a video. So, um, yeah. What we're gonna do is... We're gonna combine these three. Because I do not need any one of those. Oh, the Haradric staff gets to get out of here. Ah... Uh, why? Why useless again? Why does it have to be useless always? Every single time. Oh well. Let's go talk to Kaelin or whoever is in charge of the castle, Jeren. Hello. You may enter the palace. I know. When the troubles began here, I allowed the terrified harem guilds to join me within the safety of the palace. All was fine until one night. Screams echoed up the stairwells from the harem. My guards arrived to find the poor girls being slaughtered by a merciless band of hell's spawned demons. Hell spawned My demons. brave guardsmen tried to push the demons back into the mysterious rift from which they came. Ever since, my men have fought a losing battle. Demons have continued to pour through the rift into the palace. Ultimately, I hired Greys and his mercenaries to help protect the rest of my fair city. Drognan believes that the Arcane Sanctuary lies buried underneath this palace, since Lutgalane occupies the site of an ancient Vigerite. Thank fortress. you! Thank you for granting me to you access to your Take demon care. wives! Ah, oh, my god. I have heard of your many deeds of skill and bravery. I feel I can trust you with something I have been hesitant to speak of. Drognan and I have concluded that the Dark Wanderer who passed through here recently was Diablo himself. Drognan believes that Diablo is searching the desert for the secret tomb where the great Horadric mage, Talrasha, keeps Bale imprisoned. You must find Diablo and put an end to the terrible evil that has fallen upon our city. Drognan is wise and is sure to have some helpful advice for you as to how Talrasha's tomb may be found. It may take you quite some time to find the tomb. May you be ready when you do. Okay. So, um, obviously, I have had a, f a, s a few. <clears throat> pardon. I have had a few misjudgments about the location of Talarsh's tomb, but we are going to talk to Drognan right now and see what he has to say. Why don't bubbles appear anymore above their heads? Approach and let's trade. Talrasha's tomb is hidden deep in the desert among six others. Talrasha's symbol marks the true tomb. If you want to know what that symbol is, you should be able to find it within the legendary arcane sanctuary. So I have I have uh, two ways to go. And from here on, go inside the arc go inside the arcane sanctuary clear it out, level up a little bit, or go around the desert searching for the six tombs. Hmm. Which is gonna be smarter? Well, of course, a harem. Now, where are those women at? I guess these are dead bodies or pillows. 
Oh wow. That was a long journey. But I want to explore. Because exploration in, in this game is so very reward. What? I cannot understand. What is the difference between the harem level 2 and the harem level 2? Well, we're gonna go th through here. Probably nothing is different. Oh, uh, what? Oh. oh my god, that scared the hell out of me. That scared the living hell out of me. Now. Well, I expected you this time around. Ugly beasts. Okay, dude, you should really, really start to open your the doors for yourself. I mean, come on. You're not a little kid anymore. Stop shooting at me! Oh, my God! Are you annoying? Bastards. Okay. Well, that's that for the horror archers. Another grand charm. Why am I not surprised? Stop appearing! Oh. Okay, grand charm. Ooh, a nailed rune. Now we can combine a few of those. Mm, dead guards. Some dead guards, at, at least. <laughs> wow, this place is an absolute maze. I can tell you that for a fact. You know what we're gonna do? I'm going to explore this place. And for the sake of the length of the video, of course. Uh, we're gonna skip to the part where, oh my god, to the part where I find the next level and the second entrance, of course. So just, yeah, I was, we'll just skip. Oh my god, nothing better than to explore in this game, I mean I adore exploration. Seems like, well, uh, what we found out is that the uh, entrance from the the left staircase goes in here and the uh, entrance from the right staircase goes in here so it's safe to assume that the uh, level design uh, per se level design is um, set up so that uh, uh, these are in the opposite uh, in the opposite ends of the square so probably if uh, this is the, the palace cell level 1 and we have the same thing over here and then we have the two entr entrances right there so if uh, there is a squarish structure to the next level to the cellar it's probably gonna be the same at least I assume like that also I just found a few items that are not of interest and this one uh, this one is broken. I had not noticed that up until now. So what we're gonna do first, go back to town, and we're going to talk to Farah. I think should be the most appropriate choice. Good day. Hello. We need some armor. Preferably something that's good. I don't think I'm gonna find anything in here though. I need new items, for real. I mean it. <sighs> okay, let's see what what we can gamble. Because honestly, I have so much gold and Good day. I have no use for it. Let's just see first. First, I want to see what you have for, tr for trade. Lightning resist. Some stupid stuff. Some misc. <laughs> Nothing of value. How about mm, bone helm, not full helm? Well, I certainly do have a lot of. Well, would you look at that? I mean, fifty thousand. I have fifty-three thousand. So let's just buy this one and see what it's worth. 
Two two energy. Wow. Okay. Useless. Let's do another gamble, shall we? Mm. Skullcap. Poison link. Okay. I'm gonna put that on for now. I look absolutely retarded, but it's still some defense. It's better over nothing. Oh. Well, I have the best mercenary of all, so I don't really need you at this point of time. <sighs> I am so sad. Anywho. Oh, cheers. I, I had not noticed that. Um, let's go to the palace cellar, shall we? So if this really has a squarish structure, we can probably power through it by going through the dune beasts and some ooh, elite skeletons thank you for your experience oh dang oh, so, oh healing potion hmm what have I given you I know superior beat him let's see what uh was that a that's short spear not actually what I can't quite what I need a trident hmm just place some stuff in the Haradra cube get some more inventory space okay so a rejuvenation potion and a minor healing potion and a normal healing potion oh the mages Ow, 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 stop, stop, oh my god, stop missing, you moronic assassin. Oh. Sometimes, this game, sometimes. Come on. So we're assuming, we are making the assumption that it has a... <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> I'm truly in... Honestly, sorry about this, guys. My voice is... Well, that's what happens when you drink and sing a lot. Hmm. Hmm. Now I need to enter this place. How do I do that? Oh, I have to go around. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. <gasps> oh my god, the waypoint. I almost missed that one. Well. Well, let's go to town then. Loot Gulane. And welcome to Loot Gulane. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. Um, probably not as good. I think it's safe to make that assumption. So, be gone from me. Repair some of this equipment. Okay, so the Grand Trump... Oh my god, is it good. I mean, is it good. So let's see what we can make expendable in here. Okay, this is getting... Hmm. Inventory management in here is so hard. I mean, come on. Okay, and the small charm of dexterity too is gonna get... We're gonna get rid of that one. And what we're gonna do is... Actually, you know what? Screw that. Screw it. I don't care. I don't care anymore. I do not really give a damn. Oh, oh I collected three of those. Well, that's gonna be good. Hmm. Nice. Now, do we have three of these? Nope. Only two. Still good enough. The Haradric staff will remain inside of the Haradric cube. Now. We have three blue gems. Three blue jewels. Now, if I recall correctly, you can combine the same jewels into one... No. Nope. Not at all. Jewels are jewels. 
and can just keep them in as jewels. I'm gonna have to do some inventory management while not filming. That's what I'm gonna have to do. So, oh, oh, correct. Okay, we need to get the better, uh, the better level rune. Mm hmm. Sorry, I'm bothering you, ladies and gentlemen, with this awful crap. But, oh yes. But bear in mind that this is all a nephron nice. This is all a, a part of the the gameplay. So I just want you to have the the fuller experience of the game as to the problems that I am ex uh, that I am actually having to bear with. So let's just return to the palace. And if this really does have a a uh, square design, which uh, which I certainly doubt. Ah. Oh my God, am I an idiot? Yes, of course it had a squarish design, but I found the other entrance. I have. Been, oh my God, I've been going towards the other entrance, which is not the smartest thing to do. So I th there should be um. Yes. It is safe to assume that. Okay, so probably if there is a level three, it's going to be around here somehow. So if I just oh my god, is that guy big? I mean, come on, look at that fella. He's he's absolutely huge. This guy will take care of a while. Oh my god, I gutted him so bad. I mean, this is... He's a good to spilling all over the place. And there is blood. Hmm. Greenish stuff. Not my favorite, I might add. I hate poison in this game. Well, it's good that I have, uh... Quite the few poison resistance then. And there we go. Yes, I have figured this place out. But I will have to go through it once. We're done with this video. I mean, oh, experience shrine. Kill more monsters. Well, I'm gonna have to explore this time around. I'm sorry, guys. Oh. Damn. Oh. Nation healing, healing. Chain boots. Get overly excited for a pair of boots. But still, experience shrine will grant me more exper experience while killing some monsters. So I'm just gonna kill them all. Got to kill them all. You've got to kill them all right away. Oh my god, the huge guy again. Good thing I stacked up my ultimate. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on, Dragon Strike. That is my ultimate. Oh, oh. Owned, baby. You have been owned. Getting some gold. And we have so much. Oh yes! Whoops! Almost died. Almost dead. There. Good thing the assassin is immortal in this game, unlike the barbarian in the beginning. But but things tend to turn around. Wow. Okay. So probably the palace level three does not have the same structure as the other palaces, seeing that. Um, I cannot target the door for some reason. There we go. Hiya! Oh my god, my new microphone, by the way, is on, on it. Uh, my new microphone has been already ordered. But shipping to Bulgaria tends to be quite expensive and quite slow. Seeing as we are nearing a third world world country and I mean it oh my god well if the palace uh, the palace harem level 3 uh, oh this is the cellar actually so if the palace cellar level 3 has the same design as the previous ones and is the last of these. 
probably the entrance to the Arcane uh, Sanctum is either in its, uh, in the middle, or what? I almost died there, sorry about that. It's, uh, either in the middle, or in this upper left, uh, upper right corner of the map. So we're gonna check the middle one first. Because I want to be absolutely sure that it's not in here, and it's not. Oh my god, we've leveled up so much during- WHAT?! No, 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 no. Um, hey, Pikesman, Pikesman, yeah. You go in first, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna cover you, man. Like, I'm gonna take care of the archers, and you take care of the big fat guys that deal tons of damage. What the hell is this place? Um, hmm. What have I done? Where the hell is this place? I mean, come on. I feel that we're going around in circles. Well, even... Even... Oh, okay. It's... It is in the middle. It was in the middle oh, the whole time. Okay, special invaders. Oh my goodness! Okay, Fire Eye, you do way too much damage. You need to be destroyed. And where the hell is my guy? Yo, my guy. Come here. Come here. I need you, man. I need you because you do so much damage and no good attacking. Ouch. That was a neat corpse explosion. A vulge. Oh. I screwed up there. Picked up the wrong potion. Apologize for that. All rejuvenation potions go into the Haradric cube where they... Where they're gonna be combined. Now, I want to see what a vulge is. What the hell is... Mm, nice. But this one... Is quite good. Okay, we're gonna go through the portal. Inside the Arcane Sanctuary. There we go. Now, Loot Gulain, I want to... I want to see if I can get a gear upgrade for my guy because he's absolutely amazing, and I'm I, I, I'm absolutely sure that you guys are going to agree with. It. Requirements minus twenty. Well, this is stupid. It is an honor to a worthless enchantment. Christ. Faster hit recovery. Dexterity sh six to maximum stamina and repairs durability every thirty three seconds. Basically making my items indestructible. Rendering my gear absolutely indestructible. Well, this repairs durability is in every single way superior to the percent hit recovery. A quest log. Okay, let's see. Find the... Horizon's journal. Probably in Horizon's journal, we're going to uh, through Horizon's journal. Actually, is it, uh, is the location of? Oh my God, a hell clan! What the hell is that? I am familiar with you guys, so not a new mob, but a hell of a lot gold. Hmm. So. Through Horizon's journal, as I was saying, is the location of Talash's tomb going to be revealed to us? Oh my god, I feel that while talking, my throat uh, tends to tense up in such a fashion that I am rendered unable to speak, unable to uh, get any any sound out of it. Oh my god, is this loud. My microphone is so quiet! Phew. Okay, you block that path. Just block that path. A green amulet! Yes! Oh my god, is that a luck. 
that's a certain stroke of luck there. Replenish life and regenerate mana. Well, I'm gonna use that one. Even though it's not actually very good. I, I have none equipped at this moment, so... A replenish life is not actually gonna be that bad. Well, let's go through this teleport. And just kill the ghoul lords. Hmm. Die, man! And you have been killed. Now let's destroy the rest of the health clan and explore a little bit. What the hell did I just pick? Oh, heraldic shield that takes up all of my inventory space. Well, that's kind of useless, isn't it? Spectres, how wonderful. I need to change my main ghoul weapon. I mean, even though sometimes it does 23 damage, the bottom... Oh, a healing potion. The... The bottom end of the damage range is so low, I mean, it's only two, but the durability is insane. I need better weapons. If I can get my hands on Natalia's gear, that would be amazing. Where the hell did I disappear? Oh well. I'm just gonna destroy the health plan. You know what guys? This is what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna just skip ahead, like, real fast. And just explore the whole place. That's what I'm gonna do. Well there, ladies and gentlemen, we finally cleared out this hellhole. And uh, as you may have noticed, it took a hell of a long time. And I mean it. It took so long because if you notice, this is this is the waypoint. Okay, this is where I spawn. This is. We went first, we went through here, right? This is big. This is, look at, look at how big that is. Then, I did the stupidity of going this way. Then, I went this way. Found nothing. And now, finally, I went through here. to unravel the mysteries of this place and you know what bothers me the most about it is that I missed the fight with the summoner which I will explain a little bit when we get there for now let's just walk a bit now um I found a few things first off uh, the, this guy dropped um where did it go yes he dropped the angelic halo and if you remember, I sold the angelic chest because I found this one, which was that the other one, the angelic had 48 defense, but had only three damage reduction. And here we have damage reduction by one, but the attacker takes damage of one. We have poison resist, we have mana, we have enhanced defense and faster hit recovery, which is quite a lot better than we would used to have. And this is an unidentified helm that I don't know what to do with sorry about that <coughs> my throat gave me a little bit of a of a nudge right there so when I reached this place like I mean right here the quest log updated and it said kill the summon and there was this guy shooting out some mm, annoying stuff right here this this guy so he, he shot a bit oops spoilers Oh well, who who who, who cares? <clears throat> anyway, so he shot some ice spells at me, and I was low on life. I didn't have any potions, so I was dodging it quite a bit. And then we will find Horizon's journal. So let's see what Horizon has to say. Seekers of the tomb of Tal Rasha will find it through the portal, but know that the glowing glyphs recorded here in my arcane sanctuary are the signs of the six false tombs. The missing seventh sign marks the tomb of Tal Rasha. Of the Herodrum, he might be called the foremost. It was a shining but brief moment for the mage clans when they set aside their differences and worked together against the common enemy. The Herodrum relentlessly pursued the three across the desolate empires of the east and even into the uncharted lands of the West, 
leaving the Archangel Tyriel's hands unblemished. Presuming the three to be vanquished, the Horondrum's unstable fellowship began to dissipate. Abandoning their sacred charge to safeguard the three soul stones, the disparate mage clans began to squabble amongst each other over petty differences. Their conflicts not only dissolved their brotherhood, but strengthened the evils which they had buried beneath the cold earth. So basically the Haradrim Brotherhood is a collection of, of mages, different mage clans who once upon a time in, uh, encased in these uh, soul gems the three evils, Diablo, Mephisto and Baal. And Tal Rasha was one of the Haradrim's mages who decided that he would sacrifice himself in order to keep Baal's soul stone. But if you saw from that so, so, so basically what Harazan's journal told us is that he he recorded uh, I was just looking at the signs um, in uh, the record in the Harazan's journal is that the mages actually split up because they're idiots rendering the three evils actually a lot more powerful than they were before and that led to the Wanderer actually being able to uh, get the Soul Stone from Tal Russia, and I believe that the Wanderer is Bail, but but we will see. So this th this concludes our episode for today. Wow, for me it has been long. For you, I don't I don't know how long it's gonna be for you, but I had a long episode, maybe more than two hours. Because of this hellhole right here, you exchange Sanctum, I hate you. Also, through the means of observation, I have noticed that we have uh, these symbols right here, and this, actually, this little, if you see it, the two, uh, two arrows is missing. So, I have to look in the Canon of the Magi, of the Magi, I think it is, the Canon of the Magi, for this, uh, for the tomb with this symbol on it. So let's just go to the Canon of the Magi and grab ourselves the the waypoint. So thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, <laughs> subscribe to these videos, and I will see you next time.